Diplo with his self-titled album Diplo. Um, a little bit disappointed by this one, to be honest. I was expecting a few more bops on this record, and overall, I have quite mixed thoughts on it. I think when the tunes slap, they slap. Don't Forget My Love With Miguel was one of my most played tracks of the year for a reason. It's an absolute banger. The tracks with Paul Wolford were. The track with Tusha is great, with Karine Lomax. Um, there was a few tracks I hadn't heard before, like the one with Lil Yachty. But overall, I'm just a bit disappointed. There's a lot of sort of very average or generic house cuts on here. The track with Buster Rhymes and the track with Jungle were disappointing. The track with Aluna was a remix of a track they've already done. And while it was nice, it would have been cool for them to do another collaboration. Um, it's, I mean, it's, it's not an album that feels long, but it's almost an hour. So I was hoping for a few more bops, like I said. I think Diplo's production is kind of by the numbers. Like, there's the bangers on here, as I said, but there's nothing on here different or particularly that interesting from him. It's just he's going in a bit lot more of a housier direction. But overall, yeah, it's 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 okay for a dance record. I was expecting a bit more, to be honest. Kind of a bit disappointed, but... The bangers that are here are pretty good, and I'll keep on listening. <laughs> 